I'm James Fox, I'm in the Mixed Paralympic Cops 4. Uh, I've been rowing since I was 11 years old, I'm now 26, so 15 years. Um, biggest achievement so far is probably the Rio Paralympics where we won gold. Um, and now I'm trying to do it again in Tokyo. It's odd because we're racing against our friends. Um, I'm predicting that I'm going to be racing against, against Dan, who I actually went to Rio with, so he's Paralympic gold medalist as well. That says two things. Firstly, I'm racing against my friend, and also it's stiff competition. He's very good at what he does, and I've got to be on my top game to beat him. Um, that's great for us because it means that whatever the result, we're going to have a really strong team going into the World Championships and even next year into uh, Tokyo Paralympics. Rio is probably my proudest moment, but I probably wouldn't say it was my favourite moment. I, I won Henley when I was 16 years old, and in the grand scheme of things, it's not, it doesn't mean much, but I, I was so, so happy. It was the happiest I've ever been, I think, after a rowing race, and it's odd because I wouldn't expect that. I would have expected that Rio would be my uh, happiest moment. I think the overwhelming emotion after Rio was relief because we'd gone in the previous three years, we won the World Championships. You can't really win. I, I know it sounds horrible and, and backwards, but you can't really win. If you've won the p previous three years, you're expected to win. So if you win, great. If you lose, then what happened? The media pick up on it and everyone's tearing to shreds, basically. Um, it's strange. Sport is a very odd thing. Um, yeah, Henley, Henley Royal Regatta, my first ever win. 